My name is Brenda Berman. I am the new general manager of Central Arizona Project, and I couldn't be more excited about the opportunity. I have been working for 25 years in Western Water. That's largely been on the Colorado River, but that's been on Arizona issues across the state. Our interior rivers, our environmental issues. I've been working with tribes for a number of years. I've had the great opportunity to work across the West, but I came back to Arizona for a reason, and that's because we have incredible challenges to face at CAP for our water customers, for our partners, and we're gonna do that. Our history at Central Arizona Project is about harnessing our state's Colorado River supplies and bringing that into almost six million people, to tribal lands, to agriculture. That's our job, and I think that's the most incredibly important mission. And that's because it's, it's everything here in the desert. 2023 is going to be a very important year for CAP and for Arizona water users in general. We are looking at diminishing Colorado River supplies. We are looking at our great big reservoirs on the Colorado River, Lake Mead and Lake Powell. They're falling. They're falling because you know, we're using too much water. They're falling because of climate change, because we are at 23 years of drought. And so we're working together within the state with our partners, our contractors, the tribes, and the federal government, but we're working outside the state with our partners across the basin. We are all working together to make sure that we have a reliable water supply. When we look to the future, we know that we need to be looking for more flexible water supplies. That could mean augmentation, meaning we go find water from new sources and we bring it into Arizona. Or it could mean using the sources we have, the water we have stored underground, desalinization, recycling. These are all things that we're looking at as a water community. And Central Arizona Project is the conduit, as the canal that brings those water supplies in. We're working with our partners and our contractors uh, to look at that flexibility. How do we move water? How do we make sure that water gets where it needs to go? It's gonna be a very challenging year, 2023, but we are looking forward to it and we're gonna find those solutions. That's no easy task. It's something CAP is very good at. We have the expertise, we have the modeling, we have the professionalism. We will get this done.